Welcome back to another episode of Rock Boys Football. Some massive news late Monday night for the Georgia Bulldog fans coming out of the recruiting trail. Five-star edge rusher Isaiah Gibson committing to Georgia. We kind of talked about this when Isaiah Gibson committed to USC way back in the spring and just said, hey, Kirby Smart is not going to let Isaiah Gibson get out of state without a fight. And Kirby Smart is the most tenacious recruiter on the recruiting trail doesn't give up on Isaiah Gibson, gets him committed in this 2025 class. And from what you're reading, it sounds like Justice Terry also trending to this Georgia program. And when you start taking a look at what this defensive line class could be for Georgia in 2025, Isaiah Gibson, Justice Terry, potentially Elijah Griffin, that is going to be a special class on the defensive line. And it's something that we talked about during the 2023 season for Georgia where George's defensive line is still damn good. Don't get me wrong on that, but we kind of talked about maybe lacking some of that true top end talent in that 2023 season. Kirby Smart, he's not going to let that happen again. And he seems to be putting together just, you know, one of those classic special defensive line classes for this Georgia program. And you look at Isaiah Gibson, I know Georgia fans, I'm sure, are quite familiar. With Isaiah Gibson's game, this is one of the highest upside edge rushers that you see in this 2025 class. And kind of reminds me a little bit of Nolan Smith coming out of high school. Not necessarily, I think Nolan Smith had a little bit of a higher play strength than Isaiah Gibson. I think that's going to come as Isaiah Gibson kind of puts some more weight on. But the length, the athleticism, the electric first step off the line of scrimmage, Isaiah Gibson has all of those traits. I mean, the upside for this kid is is so extraordinarily high. And if he gets developed the right way, which Georgia seemingly does with all their defensive linemen, you are, at least in my mind, looking at an All-American caliber player for this Georgia program. Before we get into the film, just want to say thank you to you guys and to the Georgia fans. Second commitment of the day, obviously, Dontrell Glover earlier this morning. I love talking to this program on the recruiting trail. The amount of support you guys continue to show truly does mean a lot. If y'all do enjoy the content, consider subscribing to the channel. And without further ado, let's get into this one. Let's just start with the basic physical traits that Isaiah Gibson has. And it starts with that first step that is kind of just next level for someone who's 6'4", 245 pounds. Then you start looking at some other aspects, a seven foot wingspan, 10 inch hands. I you go down the list of boxes you want to see checked for elite caliber edge rushers. There's not many boxes that Isaiah Gibson does not check. And then I think what really makes him special, not only the length, the hand size, the get off off the line of scrimmage, the flexibility and the functionality of how Isaiah Gibson moves. I mean, his ability to bend around tackles on that outside shoulder. It it's really special for someone six, four, 245 pounds. It shows up in terms of the production at the high school level, his junior year, 17 sacks, 54 quarterback pressures. This is a guy that you can line up at the five technique, potentially if he puts on weight at the three technique, but certainly at that wide nine as well, just move him all along the defensive line, at least in my mind, just a true pass rush specialist. Then again, going back to Georgia in the 2023 year, I think you could be a little bit critical if Georgia had that elite pass rusher on that defensive line last year. We think Mikel Williams is going to be that guy in 2024, but you could make the argument that it really wasn't there in the 2023 season for this Georgia program. It certainly is going to be there over the next couple of years for Georgia getting into the film. And I think it starts with just his get off off the line of scrimmage. Again, it's really, really hard to find a prospect with his size and his length that moves the way he moves. And he can win in a variety of different ways, right? He can win with that length, just using his hands for tackles, getting off tackles, going and grabbing the quarterback. I think this second rep, this second rep is one of the more impressive reps that you're going to see on the film. I mean, this ability to bend at the, I mean, that that's next level stuff in terms of the flexibility that he has in that lower half, running the arc, going out, making a play on the quarterback, Those are the type of things that make Isaiah Gibson the ceiling just so high for this kid and wins in a multitude of different ways. Like With that length, if he just wants to put hands on opposing offensive linemen, push him right back into the quarterback, he can do that as well. Now, do I agree with having the H-back pick up Isaiah Gibson one-on-one and pass pro? Absolutely not. That's kind of what you deserve for kind of having that matchup, so to speak. This is a kid that the sky's the limit, moving all around, kind of playing more of that 
a little bit of that Fortech there. <laughs> I mean, I said the play strength maybe isn't as good as Nolan Smith. Maybe I need to re, uh, readjust my evaluation there because his ability to fire off the line of scrimmage, get those long hands on opposing offensive linemen, and do whatever he wants, you start working at or start looking at the athleticism, his ability to test offensive linemen from an athletic stand, but also the power that he has in his hands in the length and kind of knowing how to use it. I mean, just ragdolling that offensive tackle going out, making the play. This is in my mind, a true game record, game record, excuse me, for this Georgia program on the defensive line. Again, tacking the outside shoulder, having some flexibility in the lower half, making the play. The ceiling is just so freaking high. And you look at this 2025 cycle and say, all right, top five in the country right now. We have Zayden Walker, top 10 national prospect, Isaiah Gibson, top 20 national prospect. The spooky hours that kind of scare a lot of, uh, as a Michigan fan, quite frankly, scares me a little bit, is what happens if Elijah Griffin, Justice Terry commit to this Georgia program. You are looking at the number one edge rusher, the top two defensive linemen in the class, and oh wait, the number one linebacker in the class, Zayden Walker, going to be playing behind that defensive line. This is shaping out to be a special class for Georgia, specifically in the front seven. You look at where Georgia has made their money, and they've made it in the front seven. <laughs> they've just been dominating teams along the line of scrimmage, and this 2025 class just reflects why Georgia has been so good. Massive commitment late night, Monday night, for the Georgia Bulldogs. We'll cut it there. Appreciate you guys rocking with it. Again, if y'all do enjoy the content, consider subscribing to the channel. Appreciate you guys. We'll talk to y'all later. Peace.